Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am at Value Village because they have a 50% off sale. I am so pumped for their 50% off sales. I'm going to be going to a few Value Villages today. Hopefully I find some gems. If not, that is okay. I just want to go thrifting. It will be super fun. It is a nice day out, so I am super, super happy. So yeah, I am running a bit late. Like, there's already a big lineup in there, so let's just go thrifting. I just got in and I'm super excited. I have no idea where I want to go first. Um, I don't know. I'm gonna, I gotta quickly decide, but let's go first in. So I'm just in the jackets right now because you know, I definitely need some more, you know, coats because I do not have enough, but I'm just, I don't know. I don't really know where to go. I just like really don't have a plan today. So I'm just kind of browsing, you know, whatever I feel like. This is actually a really expensive coat. I have this in like the full size parka, and I'm pretty sure I spent like two fifty or three hundred for it. So that was a really good deal for ten bucks. It is a short one, and I don't really need any more coats, so I'm gonna leave it. They have so many denim jackets here; it's insane. Like I've never seen this many denim jackets in the store before, or Value Village. I mean, look at this! I just found a Levi's denim jacket. That's pretty cool. So it'd be only like eleven dollars, but I don't know. I kind of like oversized one, and I just don't need any Levi's, so I'm just gonna pass, and someone else can have it. I'll be nice. Oops, some guess. This jacket's really nice. I actually really like this. It is pure wool, and it's thirty dollars. So it'll only be fifteen, but oh, is it vintage? Oh my gosh, look at this! Look at this vintage one. You can tell it's vintage because they have these like union tags, so that's a little tip for you if you're ever looking for vintage. If it ever has a union tag, it's 100% vintage. But wow, actually this is really cool. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna try this on. Put that in my cart. I also just quickly went to like the denim section and I ended up finding these really like nice, like kind of really worn Levi's. And I think they'd be perfect to make into shorts for summer coming up. So I'll probably do like a thrift flip with that and they're only $11. So it'll be like, like $5.75. So like, that is crazy. So those are my first two items so far, but it is not too busy yet. Like it's gonna get packed any second pretty much. So I'm like quickly like rushing through some sections before it gets too busy to try to film because once it gets really, really busy, I will not be able to. I have been looking for like a long coat for a really long time. So this one's really, really cute. It's kind of light, so it'll be nice for spring. It's $18, so you know, it'll only be like $9, but this is really cute. It's really, really nice and soft. Look at this slip dress, it is so pretty. Oh wait, is it stains on it? No, no stains on it. I don't know. It's kind of... No, maybe it's not too short. Yeah. I'll put it in my cart and try. How much is it? Oh, that's good. That's good. There's, a, there's also this brown one. So there's the sunset. Um, no, I don't really like that one. Now that I looked at this slip dress, it is too short. So I'm gonna leave it there and not try it on. I just found this Tommy skirt, which is really, really cute. I don't know about like the buttons here. I don't know if I can rock that, but I thought it's really nice. It is 15, so it'll be 750. So that's like, that's fine. That's not bad a price, but mm, I don't know. I'm not like 100% on it. So I'm gonna have to leave it. Especially handmade by Joan. That is so cute. Too bad I'm not a cat person. Look at this Tommy shirt I just found. It's like all bedazzled. That's cute. The one thing that I've been really, really wanting is a pantsuit. No, not like a pantsuit, like a two piece kind of suit. And I'm gonna look through all of them. Hopefully, I find one today because I've been wanting one for so long now.
luck in the pant suits or pant and dress suit area. Whoa, whoa, look at these. <laughs> Maybe they're designer like last time. Probably not, but you never know like where I missed out last time with that jacket, denim, pants into like a dress, but ooh. Those are cute. I've been looking for more plaid pants. I don't know what size they are. So you can say I'm doing pretty well. I'm actually doing pretty well. I thought I wasn't going to do very well because I wasn't doing well at the beginning, but you know, it's starting to turn around. I found this sweater with, if you watched one of my past thrift with me, I found one just like this, a little similar, and oh my gosh, it is so cute. I absolutely love that sweater, so I'm gonna definitely gonna try this one on, and it's only gonna be 450, so that's crazy. I'm in the short section, and I found this really, really cute skirt. I have a big thing for skirts, and it's like the Liz Claiborne. Oh, it doesn't say sports. I like really like the Liz Claiborne sportswear, um, but these are really cute. They're size four, so they should fit. So I'm gonna try them on. They are 849, so you know, 425, not bad. And then I also found this pair of longer shorts, which I think is really cute. I kind of want a couple pairs of longer shorts for the summer. So I'm gonna try those on. Those are 10, so they'll be five. So not bad, you know, slowly growing my cart, you know, really, really big, but I gotta like get in the change room soon before it gets like too crazy. These are really cute shorts. Like they are from a garage. They're not like an expensive brand, but look, only 550. So they'll end up being like 275, which is really cheap for shorts. I'm like, really? Well, those are really short. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oops. Those are incredibly short. Ooh, got some Hawaii. I feel like I keep like getting cut off and not finishing my sentences. I have no idea what I just said, but. I just get way too distracted when I'm thrifting because there are just so many good finds here. Look at these shorts I just found. They are so pretty, except they're size 12, so they're obviously not my size, but they honestly don't look that big. And I love an oversized short and they're like $4. So I think I'm gonna try, oh, that's not the right hanger. I think I'm gonna try them on and just see how they work. Cause really, they're, they're $2 and they're gorgeous. Like I could, get them to fit me and actually like tailor them but I don't know I do love an oversized short holy moly it is so busy here it's only like 8 23 but usually people don't show up till 10 because that's when people think it opens but they actually put the hours on the front of the door so everyone knew it opened up at 9 so it's really busy and it really sucks I usually like coming here at 9 and then it doesn't get busy till 10 so it's really nice to shop but they figured it out dang it but yeah. Ooh, found some Lulus here. Look at that. They're like brand new too. Doesn't even look worn. They're size 12, but you know, that's only gonna be like 12.50 for someone. So that is a score for whoever finds these. Look at this vintage skirt I just found. That is so cute. I don't know if this is like me, but it is really cute. What size is this? Um, 7 8, yeah, that looks more like a 2. That is definitely not 7 8, so definitely vintage, but mm, I don't know. It would be like 250, so that's like a really good deal, but mm, if I'm not in love with it, you know, I'm just not gonna get it. Look at this skirt. They have some crazy wild stuff here today. Honestly, this is not the first thing I found today that has been very, very wild. You know, maybe it's designer, who knows? Only $7.99, so it's only four bucks, but mmm. I'm sorry, but this is gonna be a pass. Oh my god, this is my childhood dream to have one of these roller backpacks, you know? We're all at school in like grade three with one of these. These were like the coolest things. Okay, so I'm doing pretty well. My cart's pretty full. I think I'm gonna go try this stuff on before it gets like crazy busy lineups for the change room. So I'm gonna go try on and then I'm gonna like head to the shirts and just look through those because I don't really need to try them on. So that's my plan. I'm gonna go try on right now. Okay, so I just went to the change rooms and the lineup is ginormous, so I'm not gonna go try on because I'm just gonna keep thrifting and looking through the stuff, but I don't know, I might not even try on anything. I might just guesstimate and buy, I don't know. I really don't know. I'm just gonna go back to the aisles now because I'm not waiting in like an hour lineup when, you know, it's really early. It's like 9.47 and it's already like packed. Like definitely it is way busier than normal. So I was gonna go to the shirts, but then I got distracted in the sweaters and I haven't been to the sweaters yet, but I saw this jersey, which connects jersey, so it's only $10, which is a really good deal for a connects jersey. But then, I don't know the player, unfortunately. I was hoping that it was plain, 
because I'm going to a game soon. I've always wanted to have a jersey to go to the game, but now I'm going to have to look him up. I wonder if he's an old player. I, you can tell I am not a huge sportsman. I just like going to the Canucks games every once in a while. And then I also found this sweater, which is gorgeous. And look, $2.75. I am so in love with this sweater. It is very oversized and comfy, so it'd be nice to just lounge around in, you know, work. Oh, shoot. Yeah, I am definitely gonna be trying this one on. Throw this hanger in there. But yeah, I'm super excited about this sweater. It is like the perfect color and it's like brand new. So uh, I'm pumped for that. So I just looked it up and unfortunately he plays for a team in Berlin. So he's not on the Canucks anymore. So uh, I don't know if I wanna get it, if he's not on the team. Oh my gosh, I'm the most indecisive person in the world. But then I found this other one, this Canada jersey, which is really, really nice. But then it gets left get slap I oh my gosh I shouldn't be buying a hockey jersey that I don't even know the people I found this mini mouse sweater and it is so cute because the hood there's actually ears I think that is adorable I thought this would be a kids one. Oh no I dropped it like I was saying I thought it'd be a kids one but I guess oh actually it's an extra large maybe it's a large kids but it looks like a small women's but I'm not going to Disney anytime soon so I'm gonna leave it here for someone to get it for like two dollars so here is the flower sweater. It is really, really nice. I like how oversized it is because it's like really comfy. Sometimes, you know, you get sweaters and they're too small and then they're not comfy at all. So definitely like an oversized sweater where it's really comfy. So here is the vintage blazer that I found. It feels really nice. I feel like this is like silk or something really nice inside. Um, I don't, like, I don't know if I love the top or not. I don't, I'm just like very indecisive. It is really, really nice. So I love this brown and this pattern. So, oops, sorry. So I'm definitely gonna think on this jacket and you know decide. I'm not really sure yet. I ended up finding a Harley shirt, which is really cute. It is really small, like it says medium, but it looks like more like an extra extra small or something. You see the little tiny tag there, and it's only a dollar fifty. I'll probably pass on it just because it's so small and won't fit me. But I thought that was cool. So I just finished in the Value Village and I did really well. I ended up spending $50, so I didn't think that was too bad. Not $100, I think I spent $100 last time I did the Value Village 50% off sale, so I'm happy I didn't spend too much. And I actually got a lot of really cool gems. I got a bunch of stuff for summer, so I'm super pumped about that because I needed some shorts and skirts and stuff like that. So I'm happy that I was able to find stuff that I actually really needed and not just buy stuff for the sake of buying stuff. So overall, I'm really, really happy. I'm gonna go to another Value Village now. I think I'm gonna go to one closer to my home, see how we do there is gonna be packed so probably won't be able to film that much I don't know I hope I can but it's gonna be crazy busy so let's go to the next value village so I am back home now and I am super pumped with what I found today I found a lot of things that were good for summer so I'm super pumped about that because I do not have many shorts and skirts and stuff for summer so I am very excited that I found some you know early in the season getting ready for spring and summer so I'm super pumped about that I end up setting $50 today which you know that's great, so it was $100 on for 50, so even better. I'm just really pumped. I was gonna go to another Value Village afterwards, but then something came up and I was like, eh, I already did really well at that store, so me. Uh, so I just went home, so here I am. I'm home. Yeah, that's all I really had to say, so let's get into the haul. Um, are you gonna do this on my lap? Are you gonna sit here? You can't sit on, can you sit up here? Can you sit up here or do you have to sit on my lap? Hmm? Let's see if he'll sit up here, because I kind of want to show all my clothes off. Damon. Oh, good boy. Well, I... No, I said sit. Sit. Oh, there you go. Good boy. So now we're all settled. We're good. We're good now. First item that I got was this pair of Levi jeans, which I really liked because they were nice and worn nicely on the pockets here and here. Then they also had some like nice rips here that were actually like natural. These are not like meant to be ripped, but they're just really worn. So they're nice and soft. You know, when you get really worn pair of jeans and they just like, you know, a good quality pair of jeans that are just like 
old or they're vintage or they're just really worn and those are like my favorite so I found these and you could just tell this would be perfect for a pair of shorts so I got these and I'm gonna make a pair of shorts of them just because they are size size are too too big for me and I like my shorts a little bit bigger so I was like you know these this is perfect for shorts and I thought this color was really nice for summer I do not have any black shorts or like off black or like kind of gray you know not like you know not like a harsh black you, you, you can see here anyways I do not have a pair of shorts like this color so I'm super excited to make shorts out of these and I'll probably do like a thrift look from how I make my shorts from jeans so that'll be fun too oh and I almost forgot this one was $11.49 so I ended up getting it for $5.75 I believe yeah right 11 yeah 575 so I thought that was a great deal for a pair of Levi pants I also didn't try any of this on because the lineup was freaking outrageous at the thrift store so I was like meh I'll just buy things that I think fit so if there's a try on with it it fits if there's not then unfortunately it did not fit but I'm thinking the majority of this is gonna fit or I think it's all gonna fit so I think we're fine but the next item that I found was this skirt and you know I love skirts just because they're like you know, a nice mix. They're a skirt, but the shorts. So you know, you don't feel like you can't bend over and you can't do like you can do everything in them. So I love it. It's like the best of both worlds. So I ended up finding this skirt. This one is from Liz Claiborne and Liz Wear guess line, and they were eight forty nine. So I ended up getting it for four twenty five, which I thought pretty good dang deal. And the next item I found were these pair of shorts, which I'm super pumped. I've been looking for a pair of shorts that were like longer because, you know, I have all like the, you know, classic jean shorts that aren't like too long. They're getting a little bit shorter. So I've been definitely looking for a pair of shorts that were longer. I did not have any, so I was super pumped to find these. These were like a really nice wash and they're just really pretty. They are a size 12, which these do not look like a size 12 at all i was like no way these look like probably like a six mm, yeah probably a six i would say in my opinion and they also say loose fit like um they they look they look tiny they do not look that big so i picked them up and i was like you know i don't really care if they're big like i don't know i like a loose pair of shorts anyways so i was like you know i'll just get them they were only 225 so i was like yeah i'm just gonna try them because it's it's two dollars they are from eddie bauer so i knew it was gonna be like a nice brand they you know they just feel nice quality so i ended up getting these and i'm super pumped that i got a pair of shorts for two dollars okay and the last pair of shorts that i found were these kind of brown almost like khaki shorts i don't really know but I thought these were really cute. They also have a jawstring on here, which I don't, I, you rarely see shorts that have like, kind of like a string like this at the waist. So I thought that was really cool. They're a really nice color. And I just thought they were like super basic and nice for summer. They're obviously like super soft and so nice, the material. These were $9.99, so I ended up getting them for $5. So the next item I got was a nice sweater. It is a beautiful color, so I'll, I'll just show you. It is this sweater. It is super oversized. It is from Foot Locker and it's a size large. I think it's like a woman's large, even though it doesn't say women's. I don't know. But I just saw this on the rack and I was like, oh, that color is gorgeous. So I saw it and I was like, yeah, I'm just going to get it just because this is so pretty and it's nice and oversized. So I thought this would be perfect for summer or spring, more like spring and then obviously winter again. And I just thought it'd be a nice sweater just to have on in the house and just lounge around in, you know, do my work in it, edit, I don't know. I just thought it was really cute. It was like the perfect color and and you know what? Even better, it was $5.49, so I ended up getting it for $2.75. Yeah. Okay, and the last piece of clothing that I got before we get into the accessories, because I got some accessories today, which I'm super pumped about. So let's get into the last piece. And it is, I'm really excited about this one. Um, I've been looking for plaid pants for a long time, so I'm finally able to add one to my collection. It is this pair, which I thought was so cute. They are, they look a bit big. They don't have a size on, which is kind of weird. Um, or actually they do, they're size 28, so not my typical size, it's a little bit big, but I saw these and they have a little bit of flare at the bottom. I don't think you can see that, but, but they have a little bit of flare at the bottom. And that's the kind of pants that I've been really looking for in the plaid pants or pattern pants is I want ones that kind of have like a flare at the bottom because I love like a little bit of flare in my pants. So I saw these and I was like, oh gosh, those are beautiful. So I got them even though I didn't try them on. They were only $7.99. So they're $4. Like, 
yeah yeah i'm so pumped and they actually feel like really good quality so that's even a bigger bonus i really want to you know get really nice quality clothing yeah i'm excited these are gonna be a bit big but i was like you know i don't really mind a baggy you know plaid or pattern i don't even know what this pattern checkered checkered pair of pants so i am i'm pumped for this i'm, I'm really really pumped for this find but anyways we're gonna get into the accessories so the first item I found, or the first accessory I found, was this really, really cute leather belt. I have not been thrifting belts lately. I realized I have like two pairs of belts, and I was like, oh, I should be buying belts and accessories rather than more clothes. So I'm definitely going to be going more to the accessory sections now every time I go to the thrift store because, you know, those that's like rad sections. I absolutely love those sections. So I ended up finding this belt. It is from, I believe, yeah, it's from Lucky Brand. So I thought that was really cool. It is really good condition. It's like a leather one. And I thought like the pattern on here was so cute. I don't know if you can see that, that pattern. Yeah, you can see it is gorgeous. So I saw this and I was like, yep, get to that. It was $6.49. So I ended up getting it for $3.75. No. 325 there you go 325 I ended up getting one more belt it is another brown leather belt this one was a little bit more expensive this was ten dollars so I ended up getting it for five but then I saw that it was I think believe made in Canada so I was like it's whatever it's like a vintage belt and it's in really good condition so I was like whatever it's and also it's like five dollars that's like nothing so I got it the reason why I really love this belt is because obviously it's a brown like leather one but also it has this detailing on that kind of like loop there at the front of the belt and I thought that was so unique and cute so I saw that and I was like yeah I, I like that and it looks to be vintage just because it says made in Canada and it is from Gant which I was shopping with my mom this morning and when I showed her the belt she's like oh wow that's a really nice belt that she said it was expensive so I gotta look it up, the brand again. I'm not too familiar with that one, but yeah, I got this really cute belt and you know, finally have more than two belts in my collection now. In the final item I got, which I picked up right at the very end, right before I was gonna check out, I ended up finding this cute little brown fossil purse, which I thought was so cute, just like, you know, brown, my favorite color. So I saw this and I was like, wow, that is like really cute, tried it on, and I thought it was like a nice unique shape of like this kind of rectangle, which most of mine are kind of more rectangular this way, you know? Not really this way. So I thought that was really unique. This was $30, I ended up getting it for $15, which I was like, that's pretty good. Fossil usually can range up to like $200 their purses. So I thought it was really cute. This one is definitely an older style one from what you can see. So I don't know, I was super pumped. I I love purses, so you know, I'm always excited to add another one to my collection. You came back. You came back, Basin. Oh. You want to see my thrift finds. You're not, you're not into that. You're not a thrifting puppy, huh? No. I want to say thank you so much for watching today's video. I really hope you enjoyed today's thrift with me slash thrift haul. Um, if you're still watching this video, let me know what item was your favorite. Let me know down in the comments below. I always love knowing what your favorite item that I thrift today. It is so fun to see what your guys' favorite things are because obviously it's different for me. My favorite item probably today, uh, probably the pants, the plaid pants. Those are pretty rad. I'm super stoked about them just because I've been looking for, you know, a new pair of patterned plaid pants. I don't know what they're called, but yeah. Super pumped about those. So that's probably my favorite thrift find today. But yeah, that's all I really had for today. But I just want to do a little reminder. If you do like thrifting, thrift with me, thrift flips, and all that stuff to do with thrifting, be sure to subscribe to my channel. And also follow me on Instagram, at Jenna Phipps, so you don't miss out on all the behind the scenes of my thrifting adventures. And yeah, that's all I really had to say. So yeah. But uh, yeah. Yeah, that's all. So I want to say thank you so much again. And I will see you in my next one. Bye, guys.